Hi everyone, Jeff PD here. Sorry about the long absence. It's been a couple months since my last post. So today, I thought I'd share with you my spicy salt and pepper chicken wings. It's crispy, spicy, garlicky, and it's really, really good. Okay, so if you're ready, let's get started. Okay, let's take a look at the ingredients what we need for today. I have two pounds of chicken wings, six cloves of garlic minced, one jalapeno pepper diced, half an onion diced, half a green pepper diced, half a green, half a red pepper diced, and I have two Thai chili peppers. Um, you could put more if you like, but two is probably hot enough for what uh, what we what we are accustomed to. Uh, then I have uh, one for the marinade. I have one tablespoon of fish sauce, one tablespoon of rice wine, one tablespoon of light soy sauce. Uh, and then a little bit of white pepper powder, uh, two tablespoons of cornstarch, and one egg white. And then to coat the chicken wings, we're going to need uh, half a cup of flour and half a cup of cornstarch. And then to finally assemble it at the end, we're going to need half a uh, tablespoon of salt, half a tablespoon of pepper, uh, three-quarter of a uh, tablespoon of sugar and one quarter teaspoon of five spice powder okay and and again um, what I usually do is I'll leave a full recipe on the bottom uh, of the video in the description box along with where you can get the ingredients okay all right let's uh, go ahead and prep and marinate the chicken wings all right so basically what we're gonna do is just gonna cut the wing tip off Okay, so basically you're going to find the joint of that and then just cut that off. You're going to slice into the, the joint of the other part and then break like that. That's all you're going to need to do. So again, cut along the joint of the tip. Slice the, uh, the joint of the other part here and then break. You just want it open like that. Or you can just uh, cut the entire joint too to have separate pieces. But I kind of like the big piece like that. Big reason why I um, I break the joint here is so that it wouldn't curl up when you uh, deep fry. So just open it up like that. Okay. All right. Let's uh, go ahead and uh, marinate. Pepperoni first. And just white pepper powder. Get the fish sauce, the wine, you got the soy sauce. starch okay and you can uh, marinate this for about half hour or or an hour before you do it otherwise you can just do it now. That's what we're going to do. Um, it'll be a little bit better flavor if you uh, let it marinate in the refrigerator for a little bit. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, cook this up. 
Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to heat up our oil. I got a, you know, a couple of cups of uh, oil in the wok. You can also use a skillet uh, so you don't have to waste so much oil. But uh, it is a bit of a hassle whenever you deep fry things at home. It, it's for me anyways. Okay, so we're going to heat up the oil. All right. So now we're just going to mix the cornstarch and the flour together. I'm going to dip that in here. So this is basically going to coat it real well and then shake, shake off any excess. All the chicken wings here. Be sure to shake off the excess, otherwise, the oil is going to get dirty real fast. We're going to deep fry the chicken wings for about 8 to 9 minutes until it's nice and crispy. And then we're going to add the seasoning at the end. Alright, that's all done. Take a, let's check out our oil, see if it's ready. All right. Yeah, it's ready. Oil's about 350, 375 Fahrenheit. Just gonna heat up the wok. Just a little bit of oil, not too much. Now you can add the garlic.
onions. We're gonna cook it until it's brown. You wanna get it nice and brown. You wanna get all the flavor out if you can. A good minute or two. onion and garlic. Now I'm going to put the uh, Thai chili pepper in here. Now we're going to peppers, green peppers, and red peppers. Once the pepper gets uh, a little bit soft here, then it should be about done here. Now we're going to add the chicken wings back in. Okay. Now you're going to combine all the seasoning that we have to put at the end, the salt, the sugar, the uh, black pepper, and the five spice powder.
Okay, you don't want too much salt. Um, you know, you might have some left over here, so. Uh, watch how much you put in. Okay, we're ready. We're done. Let's plate it up. spicy very garlicky Got really good flavor mm. very good I hope you get a chance to try this out um, it's good for a snack or an appetizer but we're just gonna do this for lunch okay so I hope you try it and um, please like and subscribe and uh, thanks for watching I'll see you in the next video Great, so a bunch of viewers are interested in buying these black t-shirts, Dragon House t-shirts. So if you're interested, uh, please email me at this address down here, right there. And uh, let me know what size and quantity you want. And then uh, we'll try to get some and uh, get them out to you.